The Logitech MX Keys Mechanical and the MX Keys S are two of Logitech's flagship Bluetooth keyboards. Both of these keyboards use Bluetooth low energy and can be paired to up to three devices at one time. And it's super easy to change what device it's paired to by using the device changing buttons. These two keyboards are hugely different in the fact that the mechanical has mechanical switches in the clicky blue, linear red, and tactile brown varieties. And the MX Keys S just has scissor style keys for a quiet, smooth typing experience. Beyond just the feel of the keys though, there's a couple other small differences. And in this video, we're gonna go over all the differences between the MX Keys S and the Logitech MX Mechanical. The MX Mechanical has a battery life of 15 days on a full charge or about 10 months if you don't use the backlighting. The MX Keys S has a battery life of 10 days with backlighting or about five months with the backlight turned off. In terms of color, the MX Keys S is available in graphite, black, or pale gray, but the MX Mechanical is only available in graphite. The MX Keys S retails for $110 and the MX Mechanical retails for $160. And they both include a Logitech Bolt receiver and a USB-C to USB-A cable. If you don't wanna use Bluetooth, you use the Bolt receiver plug straight into a USB port on your computer, and that acts as the wireless bridge between the keyboard and the computer. If we start to compare the buttons on the keyboards, the mechanical has two more customizable buttons on the function row. The function keys are also full size on the mechanical, while they're a little bit smaller on the keys S. When you compare the key spacing on both of the keyboards, they all feel like they're in very similar positions, but around the space bar is where things get a little bit different. The mechanical has smaller command buttons that I find to be a little bit harder to hit reliably. While the keys S, the command button is just a little bit wider, I find it to be more familiar to me as a Mac user. Additionally, on the keys S, there's no start button to the right of the space bar. Both of these keyboards work great though, whatever operating system you're using, and they will feel familiar whether you're a Windows or Mac user. And I really enjoy using both the scissor keys of the keys S and the mechanical keys of the MX Mechanical. They just offer a very different feel in terms of the typing response. The MX Keys S has more of a Magic Keyboard-like feel, although it has a little bit more travel than the Magic Keyboard, but I find it to be a little bit more of a seamless experience when I'm switching from using my iPad's Magic Keyboard or my MacBook Pro's Magic Keyboard or my Apple Wireless Magic Keyboard. It just feels a little bit more familiar to me. So the MX Keys S is obviously way quieter than the MX Mechanical is. I would definitely recommend that you buy the MX Keys S if you're working in an office where people are concerned with noise, or if you're making a lot of phone calls while typing, because that noise isn't gonna transfer over to your video call as much as it will with the Mechanical. I also find a lot of times I do really enjoy the lighter feeling key travel on the MX Keys S, but at the same time, the Mechanical is really a lot of fun to use. I really enjoy that tactile feel that the keys give, where you can just feel every single keystroke as you're typing away. You can choose between three switch types on the MX Mechanical. You can get the linear red, clicky blue, or the brown tactile keys. And in another video, I'm gonna go over the differences between these keys, so be sure to check that out. But I personally find I prefer the brown tactile keys. The tactile just feels like the best of both worlds for me of getting the mechanical sound and feel without being crazy loud or a higher sound like the clicky blue. You won't be losing out either way whether you choose to buy the MX Keys S or the MX Mechanical. They have quite a bit of overlap in terms of what the different key options are and all the different shortcuts. They both offer Logitech's fantastic Bluetooth performance that's basically second and none. And they also give you great customization through the Logitech Options Plus app. All you have to do is decide if you want the scissor feel of the MX Keys S or if you want the more tactile mechanical feel of the MX Mechanical. And also just decide if you want to deal with the noise and the slightly different spacing on the keys by the space bar on the MX Mechanical. I personally prefer the spacing of the Keys S but the more I use the MX Mechanical, I also find it to be totally usable and just fine as well. Thanks for watching this video. If you have any other questions about the MX Keys Mechanical or the MX Keys S, leave a comment down below. 
And be sure to check out my other videos because I have more in-depth reviews of each of these keyboards where I go into all the specific features for each keyboard. If you're interested in buying either of these keyboards, I have links for both of them in the description below. So be sure to check that out to get the most up-to-date pricing and availability. If you found value in this content, give this video a like, subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on any upcoming content.